Hey, how y'all doing? <clears throat> Let's do it to it. Check, check, mate. Check, check, mate. Peace. Check. Oops. Ah, check, check, man. And the peace. Okay. Got it. Trying to think if uh, queen b2 is in, and then queen takes, rook takes, knight comes there. <clears throat> Good so far, so good. Tags. I should promote. <coughs> then take. Then not uh, take. Okay. I think I can rook the one here. Queen taste, pawn taste, rook there, there, and then, yeah. Rook the one. Oh, wow. Really? Ah. 
Um, let's give that another one. Come on. Next, there, and there, and should be up a whole piece. Force him of his tags <coughs> there.
right back. Bishop back here. Good so far, so good. Bishop. 
ship tax, high tax. See how many pawns will they have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Gotta figure out. I think the best move is just taking there. I really don't see anything better. Hey. I think that's the only move. I was trying to figure out if he could block after. I think if uh, we push, push, rook there, he came over to b3. Probably, let's see, rook, let's see, on the last one, b, b1, b2, h7. Rook A8 Rook B6 or G6 and then Rook uh, G8 I think that I think that's the best continuation like if uh, if uh, I think that's B is that B let me make sure yeah I think B7 for the uh, then uh, G or H8 Rook A8. I'm just trying to figure this one out. Uh, rook B6. And then Rook uh, H8 actually is winning. I think that's for the last puzzle. That's for the last puzzle. Uh, that's how we actually win. If you if you queen, you uh, I think you're still okay. I think you're still okay if, if you... No, you're not okay if you queen because then it's equal. 
And then if he tries to play rook um, b8, you can actually take a7. Rook a t takes a7 and you're winning. And he doesn't have enough time to get to your queen. Just gotta always uh, think what your opponent's plan is, then implement a plan based, keep your plan in mind, but stop their plan and keep your plan flowing. Okie dokie. Um, I got it. Uh, queen B1 check. King H2. F3 uh, check. G2. And then uh, Queen F1. And I, that should win. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, yours is right, G3. I had G2, I don't know. That was funny. F3 and then... Yep. Um, bishop takes D5. He takes d5, and queen takes a5. There we go. Let's see if we can't uh, amp this up. Uh, bishop g4, bishop g4 check, if king b8, rook h3 traps the queen I believe. I'm thinking knight h4, but I'm not sure knight h4. I'm thinking that 
but I'm not sure if that's strong enough. Oh, 91. Oh, yeah, that makes even more sense. Yeah, draw the knight away, win the queen. Yeah, 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 that's, that. yeah, yeah, that's the best. And then you can actually uh, win the queen there. Yeah, yeah, I see that now. I, I had that on my radar, but for some reason I didn't implement that. I'm looking at knight takes e6, f takes e6, and then bishop takes uh, e6, check, king h8, and then um, I'm not sure after that. Yeah. Takes d6, but can't that uh, f takes uh, d6? Can't just queen takes d6 though? I see that now. Wow. Yeah, that, that is strong. Yeah, that, that is actually winning. There's really no way to stop the mate. Yeah. Wow. Sacrifices galore to win a position. I gotta remember, it's not about uh, uh, material superiority. It's about checkmate. Yeah, that that skewer's on uh, on a two here, and then when you force the king to c one, uh, c four, you play there. I knew that I knew queen was you. You should always go for like what you're saying is the most forcing. And then uh, make a plan after that. Queen takes uh, F7 is forced. Check. 
Hurricane H8. First of all, let's go through that, and then night, um, and H5, and I think you're right. I think that is right. Queen H5. I know it's kind of slow, but I'm. Um, might be kind of slow. Ah. I'm thinking Rook B3, maybe. Oh, you mean uh, take on Yeah, I think you're right on that that's all right. That's the right move. Cause uh, that this move actually sets up for a uh, smother mate here. Let's say the queen. Let's say the queen takes. Uh, let's say the queen takes here. Check. He plays there. Oops. Ah, quit. Quick glitching on me. Here after this, king there, knight double check, king back, queen in, king takes, not I'm not king takes, sorry, uh, rook takes, and then knight smother me. Yeah, it's a smother mate move. Yeah. That protects F2, you're right. Otherwise, the queen could come down and take on F2, and that wouldn't be really good.
one. I'm I vaguely remember this one here. I'm trying to figure out. Um, let me see. What did they? Okay. Thinking queen b7. Ah, yeah. Rook takes e7. I mean, rook takes e7. King takes e7. Then queen b7. Yeah. Yeah. That that should uh, that should take advantage, and we should win a uh, rook in that line. Our minor piece. That's that's the move that I remember now. <laughs> And if he were to move closer, we can always take with the pawn with the bishop. I mean, the bishop takes pawn and then check the king, and then they got to move away anyways. So, that handles that situation. I got it. I got it. Uh, queen uh, g5. Queen g5. Rook takes f7. Queen takes e3. Check. Queen takes e3. Or maybe we take first. Nope. All right, bishop takes e three. I might be a little bit out of out of whack here. King g two, and then king takes f seven. I think that I think there's a way to win more material. I think queen. Yeah, I was looking at yeah. Bishop takes, oh, bishop takes c1, okay. Yeah, that's right. The rook protects the bishop. Right, yeah, that's right. The last move is rook ta uh, bishop takes c1 because the rook protects the bishop. So, yeah, that, that would be, my other move's not as strong as the bishop takes c1. Wow, that was wrong. Huh. Uh, let me see. Queen H4 check. King G8.
trying to figure this one out. What, what did I miss there? Okay, after pawn takes g6, queen h4, king g8. I think he has a flight square on, um, uh, after we push, he can actually go f8 after we take. I think they run. I think it's all about running. Ah, I know what I know what the problem was. I know what the problem was. I got it now. Bishop, where would the bishop go? Bishop uh e six check e six check uh and that would be me oops I had to put bishop uh e six I think it's made if I'm not mistaken. I try to always, uh, if I get them right. Yeah, this one, uh, we remember this one here. Bishop d2. I remember this one for sure. And then uh, we can actually grab the rook. Well, can we actually grab the rook? Yeah, I think we can. Um, I think we can. Let me see. Rook, uh, king takes d4, knight f3. Uh, yeah, we could play king, um, king c3 if we had to, or king e3, and we're up a whole rook. Yep, we can actually take here. Yep, just had to make sure that, I, kn I knew taking was right, I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. <laughs> uh. I think we got this. Let me see. Queen h4 check. King g2. Rook a2 uh, check. I'm thinking that might be. Let's see. Queen h4 check. King g2. Rook a2. Oh, rook a3. Oh yeah, yeah that that does work. Yeah, cause that that threatens me. Yeah, cause the knight covers these two points. Surprisingly, if the rook comes up there, we could take and actually be up material. Yeah, rook uh, c3 is actually the. Oh wow. Yeah, she went down the mating line. Surprisingly, I thought I thought they'd play rook and try to actually hold via that way, but I don't think that actually holds. I think it still loses. So I guess they went down, uh, the opponent, or whoever played that, went down the losing line. I, didn't, I don't think they wanted to get uh, basically <laughs> obliterated on that. That would have, uh, you would have lost too much material. It wouldn't have been fun. Let's just say not fun at all. I'm saying bishop c1. Maybe it's too slow. Bishop c1. That stops the pawn promotion, so.
D3, interesting. There, 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 there. Oh, yeah. Check. Okay. <clears throat> so D so D two D three. Oh, I see. Yeah, because then now see if he plays uh, this move here, you can actually stop it with B seven. Okay. That one tempo really uh, changes the the whole scenario of the position for sure. I think that uh, I taste is three. Interesting position to say the least. I got it. I'm thinking it's uh, bishop. Bishop uh, takes f7 check. If king takes f7. Huh. Yeah. And queen takes. Just trying to sure this works. Yeah. And then uh, bishop h6 should uh, 
when on the spot. Well, yeah. Bishop h6. Yep. Retakes. Yeah. Sometimes you have to force the situation. I've learned that in the positions. Oh, this one's a straight form in one. Rook, uh, rook g, uh, g4. Rook g4 wins. Yeah. No? Oh, rotate C5. Okay, rotate C5 then. Oh! Okay. Yeah, you have to uh, trade off one of the... Okay. So you trade off one of the rest first. Gotcha. Then root G, uh, then root G, uh, four. Okay. Yeah. Pawn takes. Okay, that makes sense, because the knight guards the spot that the rook would go back to, to block. Gotcha. Yeah. I see that now. I got it. Uh, bishop c5. If rook takes d8, rook takes d8, and then g3, g3, and bishop takes a6. You're up in material. Yeah. I want to make sure. Am I doing the right rook? Is that the, is that the right rook? Yeah, the B rook. Yeah. Ah, gotcha. Then they, yeah, okay, sacrifice it back. I was gonna, I wanted to make sure because sometimes I take with the wrong rook. And that's not uh, a fun thing to have happen. I got it. Rook, rook takes um, d8. Check. Rook takes d8. E7. Rook uh, e8, and then queen. Oops. Then uh, queen c6. C6 wins.
some reason I'm thinking bishop g1, but I'm not sure if that's actually right. I'm not sure if that's right. I don't think so. <clears throat> I think that wins a pawn. Oh, I got it. I got it. Bishop uh, e uh, f2 check king e2 bishop uh, e3 check king takes uh, d3 rook takes d2 check king will say goes to uh, e4, then bishop takes h6. I think that's right, Dick. Yeah. Take on E three. And then we uh, move our we move the rook back to d uh, d3 at that point, and then we uh, pick up material. D takes E4. If B takes C4, then Queen takes B1, but I'm not sure.
see pawn takes a four Gotcha. Because why not pick up a pawn for the piece, right? Why give it up? That makes sense. Let's see here. Queen H4, check. King uh, E2. Yeah. Bishop B, uh, B5. That's right. King uh, E3. Queen uh, G3 check, uh, Queen F3, hmm. one sec, I'll be right back.
Castle can side. That that does. Oh, so we can actually castle. Ah. Uh. King safety. Uh, I have to always consider that type of an idea. Uh, Rook takes. So you rotate to e e seven. Um, rook e d eight. Queen takes d eight. Knight takes d eight. So this okay. Okay, full piece. <coughs> okay. Yeah, root D one and then yeah. Root D one, root D one, yeah. And then Queen E six. You pick up a uh um then yeah I should pick up a knight a whole piece at that point yeah the other one's just an exchange still winning still winning but it's not as strong as the the one we did but it's yeah you always have to look for the best moves Do it to it.
I'm thinking Queen takes B2. I'm thinking Queen takes B2. Takes, let's see, takes f3, just takes f3, pawn push, king f2, I mean pawn f2, check, king. I think it, I think it has to, I think it's got to be because if we did, uh, he takes uh, f3, bishop takes f3, f2, uh, check, then king f1. So, I'm thinking the reason I was looking at uh, queen takes b2 was that if bishop takes d3, e takes d3, and I don't. I think we can actually queen. Where are they? Really? Wow. Oh. Eh, interesting. Huh. Queen, uh, queen f4 to follow. Okay. I'll go with that, because I think that is... Okay. Then, uh... Rook takes e3. Um, uh, bishop f1, or if it runs... Yeah. So F two rook and then uh, then E takes. So rook F two first, and then okay, then you take. Oh, I gotcha. And then if bishop tries to there, you play rook takes E two, king takes. Ah, you get two queens. That makes sense now. Rookie one must be the move then. Rook, uh, uh, rookie one check has to be the move then. But that still is enough for a piece, isn't it? I'm thinking that the rookie one's the only way to keep any advantage. I'm I see what you're saying about that. Ah, well, maybe it's queen uh, d4. There is queen d4. What do you think about that one? Oh, wait a second. That's not... Was that strong enough? Let's see if uh, queen d4, bishop takes h7, check. King takes h7. Huh.
Okay, let's give that a go. I don't think the reason I think rookie one works is uh, the pieces aren't coordinated enough to actually be of any value at that present moment for our opponent. It's all about, at that point, coordination of your pieces. And I think our, and then yet your queen gets into the, uh, it can fork tons and tons of pieces and uh, the king is not in, it's not safe. So king safety, when you have a queen like that, is, is a vital, uh, vital importance. I don't think we can. I think um, I think it loses. It actually loses. Queen takes d6, e7 uh, check. If queen takes uh, d5, he's not gonna take. He'll just go e8 equals uh, queen. I was looking more towards my idea was actually bishop uh, e3 check bishop e3 check would be my preferred type of move sequence and then we can actually potentially pick up a um, a queen maybe So here, here, there, queens. Bishop check. Okay, and there. Check. Okay, up. And then uh, queen check mate. It's actually mate. I got it. I got the mate. Queen takes d6. e7 check. Queen takes d5. Uh, e8 equals queen. Bishop e3 check. King f1. Queen H1 check, King uh, E2, and then Queen uh, G2 equals mate.
So bishop e2, king h2. Test is says if I interesting. So here, there, 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 knight checks. Yeah, let's give that a go. Now we could actually take after checks. We could actually stop the pawn now. Nah, yeah. Now you take with check at this point. Yep. Why well, give your opponent any counterplay? That's what we have to at a certain at these levels it's all based on counterplay. I've kind of noticed that counterplay, counterplay. see here he surrendered the back rank so if uh, queen h1 bishop uh, f1 Yeah. We have to take in consideration that if we play knight h4, rook g um, g4, queen uh, h1, bishop f1, ah, knight uh, f3 check, ah, that's winning, yep, yeah. Are the rooks trapped? Okay. Yeah, I think that is right. And then check. And uh, queen takes h. Queen uh, A4, but I'm not exactly sure if that's right because of uh, Queen D4 check. I'm thinking that Queen D4 check really throws a kink in the works at this point.
I actually think that it might this might actually work Queen a4 may actually work but I'm trying to figure out if uh, then Queen uh, d4 check Queen takes d4 C takes d4 Queen um, uh, e2 maybe Queen e2 Why, how did I get queen e, e2? That's funny. I'm at king e2. Must have had a uh, queen on the brain. So you're, so you're saying king c2 first? King c2 first? But Gotcha. I think you're right. I think that is right. Uh, King C2, G2, Queen A4, G takes F1 uh, equals Queen, Queen uh, A A6 check, King C7, and then Queen uh, C8 is me. Oops. I have to I'm thinking it might be um, <clears throat> F2 if King uh, G2 Knight E1 check King takes F2 Knight takes C2 but maybe that's too maybe that's too simple of a combination I'm thinking that's that's the move sequence. Maybe first is king um E5. No. 
No, that we're uh, no, we're down material. Yeah, yeah. First is F two. This is the only way to win. Then king. Now king. Uh, now king e five. King e five is the only move. Yeah. Now king e five, and this traps the uh, the rook. And also frees the bishop up. Pawn takes. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I'm not sure. Let's get a, we'll get a moving and a grooving on it, and we may get there. Maybe. Let's see here. I think uh, I think yeah a h four is forced or h six. King D five King C four I'm thinking is right. Yeah, I'm gonna go King C four there and then now uh E five. Let's see here. Yeah. Knight, uh, knight takes, knight, uh, knight takes e5, and then knight um, h7, and we're actually, I think, winning here. Oh, knight c5. Okay, yeah, then that's mate, isn't it? Yeah, that that'd be mate, almost mate. Ah, draw the knight, draw the knight away. Yeah, knight d7, knight takes d7, pawn push. We make a queen. Yeah. Yep. I think an H3 here. I think H3 here. And then uh, H3, Queen takes H3. Rook takes a. Well, no, that wouldn't work. That wouldn't work. That wouldn't work. Nope. That's not right. F3, okay, so F3 is the move. That, and then, okay, there we go. Yeah, I had the wrong pawn. It's actually F3 here. Well, F3, knight takes... Yeah, I see that. Yeah, that does work. Yep. And then now we play uh, rook takes f6. 
rotates to f6, is forced. So rotates to f6, knight takes c2, uh, uh, rotates f, uh, uh, rotates h6, uh, which forces, it actually forces mate. There's no way really to stop mate after this move. Surprisingly, this, this is mate. Queen takes h6. That, that looks like uh, crazy, but there's no way to stop mate at that point. Rotates H3. No, that'd be mate. Can't do that. He's threatening mate, so we gotta be we gotta be fast. There there is no uh there is no waiting around here. Ah, B6. I'm thinking B6 first. B6 first. Now that B6 stops the queen infiltration. Well, maybe not. So I think the queen, B6, uh, queen takes A7. So that doesn't, that doesn't work. Um... Well, I think we got it. I think I got it. Um, root takes uh, h3. Root takes h3. G takes h3. Interesting. Huh. Interesting, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I think that I think that is right. Yeah, this is this is uh, this is correct. Cause H H four. Yeah. 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 Yeah that that this uh bishop takes g4. Yeah, there's the take here, and then back, king there, king h4, queen h4, yeah.
thinking A4 here. A4 at this point. Let's see, A4, F, uh, Queen. Hmm. Can't, can't really think where the Queen would go. This is kind of uh, confusing. Rook H5. Huh. Oh, I kind of see why now. Rook h5, and then if queen uh, e8, then knight f6. Knight f6 check, right? I think I, I see what you're saying. This is the only defensive move here. Yeah, bishop, uh, queen b3, then knight uh, c3 here with the idea of a potential fork. Yeah. Then rook h5 and. Um, Like rook, uh, yeah, rook a five, and I think a three has to be played. A three check, yeah, a three check has to be played, and then, and then now you can uh, set up knight uh, c four, and then you pick up the the queen. And your knight will eventually sacrifice itself for the pawn. Is it really this fast of a move? Let me see. Uh, G takes F2 check. King, well, King G2, Queen H2 check, King F3. Yeah, we're kind of, he kind of gets out of the position at that point. I think I think we have to play after G takes F two G takes F two. If G takes F two check, King uh, G two. Ah, uh, well, yeah, that does threaten me, doesn't it? Yeah. I was actually thinking knight um, e um, three at this point check, but he can actually play king takes f two, and then after queen f four, you have knight f three block, and so I think yeah. Yeah, that's this has to be the first move, of course. Um, check, king up, queen check, yeah, h2 is kind of a force move as well.
Queen H1. Then Queen uh, E4. King uh, D D2. Ah, you actually get to pick up a material in that line. Okay. And then uh, you can actually play. I think that wins material, yeah. Check on H. Okay, there. How are we doing on time? Perfect. I think we may be able to get to six. D5 tonight, maybe. We'll see how we do. Let's see what we got here. Let's see, root check. Okay, in there. Who takes. Uh, no, that's not what we want. Well, maybe if we play root check. Okay, in there. Queen takes. We could try there and then there. Huh. Yeah. King G1 and then, oh, F3. So pawn takes, then, uh, then you have Queen uh, H4. Yeah. Let me check. Check uh, if King up. You actually have Rook H1. And then you're. Th Oops, you can't threaten that. Hmm. Yeah, C1. And then I'm th thinking. Rook takes F3. Can't taste F3, root check. Ah, yeah, that, that does lead to mate. Well, I think I could do three more, and then I gotta call it. <laughs> now we're doing better, we're, get, we're building up our endurance, so. Bitch takes it four. D takes it four. Ah, yeah. <clears throat> there, and then you pick up a knight, yeah. That actually wins material. Yeah, you win the night. Gotta remember to look for that one. Those uh, tactics. Okay.
Yeah, I think A7 is right. And then E, uh, then, uh, B, and then A equals Queen. Yep, this, uh, that, and then you push. And, uh, you have to do kind of a Lucinda. You have to play King, uh, E4. King E4. Knight d3. Ah, then king e4. Yeah. Yeah, then king e4. And then now you can promote. Now, now you can promote with queen. Okay. Doing better. I see. I don't see anything wrong with rook takes b3. I don't see anything wrong with that. Yeah, well, rook takes uh, b3. I was looking at g4. Then uh, rook h. Rook h6. This rotates G. Oh yeah, that does. Oh, that threatens me, doesn't it? Oh yeah. Yeah, that threatens me. Ah. Uh, rook G2, Rook uh, B, G2, Rook B, G2, Rook B, G2, and then now you're threatening, uh, then uh, Rook G6 to Rook uh, H6, mate. So on my right is the rook move, uh, right rook move, rook uh, b, g2, b, g2. Rook d2? Oh, oh, I get ya. I see, I see why. Now, yeah. And then now we can play uh, rook takes g5, check, h takes g5, and rook takes uh, d7, we're up a whole piece. Okay, I have to remember that. Okay, we'll call it on on this right here. But oh, uh, so well, uh, I I uh, let's uh, do it to it. Okay, I hate having to call it, but let me see what time is it. Uh, we might be able. 
We might be able to get that. We'll try 70. We'll go, we'll go for we'll go for 70. We'll go for 70. We have five more. That, that we can do that. We'll do 70 and then we'll call it. I'm feeling uh, stronger. Let's do it. Okay. Okay, I'll be right back. Yeah. Yep, let's do it to it. Okay. Let's see right there, there, there. Say check. Let's see if we check here. Then we can actually come back and attack there. Come up, yeah. Rip B3. Yeah. Knight uh, C7. Yeah, B5. Oh yeah, I think we've had this one before. It should be D7 and then root D5, yeah. And I think this, yeah, we've had this one before. And then uh, D7, King there, and then Knight, uh, yep. And then uh, Rook uh, C7 picks up uh, material. Okay, let's do it to it. Come on, come on. We can we can get through this uh quicker and maybe able to get to eighty if we uh speed uh through these and get it get some good learning. Uh, right along the side with it. Let me see, Queen uh, F one, King uh G three. No, let me see, uh Thinking the only force you miss queen f1, king g3, 
Um, knight, uh, nope, that wouldn't work. Well, then we have queen g1, king h3. Yeah, that that is right. It's uh, queen f1, check, uh, king g3. Uh, uh, queen uh, g1 check king h3 and then queen g4 is mate I believe I'm thinking that's that's the mating line queen here here oh wait a second the queen can actually intercept I, I missed that uh, queen f1 check, king g3, queen g1 check, and then queen uh, g2, okay. 90, still okay, 94. Yeah. 94, then there, and then check, and well. Yeah, then rook check, yep, that's, that's it, 94. Okay, pawn takes uh, queen at that point. Yeah. Yeah, because the other way he blocks, we, we had to actually, um, as I like to say, gummy up the position of our opponent. Our, uh, in uh, gears, we had to put a um, something in there that would stop the, uh, all the works of the gears. And that, uh, that did, that one uh, rook move, uh, Basically made everything not work. Okay, rook f7. Rook f7. Queen takes f7. Uh, yeah. Well, let me see rook f7. Rook takes f7. Um, Ah, yeah, that's right. Cause it's it's a check. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Rook takes uh, e seven at that point. I think we're uh, winning at that point. Think are we miss? Am I missing anything? No, 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 no. Yeah, place F seven, rotation F seven. Uh, seven, rotation F seven, rotation F seven. G. Yeah. I think we could play uh, rook takes f7, rook takes f7, and probably king g8 at that point. And that might win us some material. Maybe. G7, rotates G7, G8.
Yeah, this is right. This is about six. That's right. Quid D4 is right. Ah, we have, uh, then we got uh, Bishop uh, uh, E8 check, King um, H6, and then Queen H8 is mate. Got it. Get a rolling, moving in a grooving on this. Okay, let's check out rook takes d5, queen takes d5, knight g5. I'm thinking that wins. That wins a queen at least. Rook takes d5, queen takes d5, knight uh, g5. Well, he does have queen takes g, uh, g2, and then after king takes g2, g takes, rf takes g5. So is that good enough? I think we're I think we're fine after this. Yes, I think rook takes d5. Queen takes d5. Knight uh, g5. Queen takes uh, g2. Check. Oops. Check. King takes g2. Um, F takes g5. And then rook takes, uh, queen takes e5. G5 is better. But if we uh, go knight g5, can he go f takes g5 though? I know we I know we could play um, uh, rook takes uh, g5. I I know that. I know what you're saying. Rook takes g5. I'm um, not rook takes g5. Um, takes bishop bishop takes d king there and then bishop e f oh bishop e4 which threat okay yeah that threatens mate doesn't it yeah I see what you're saying. This is actually a stronger move. Yeah, and then you yeah, have bishop e4, and that threatens, that actually holds a piece. Yeah, then, then you can actually play, bit. you can play at this point bishop e4, and then the queen has to basically take at that point. Or what we could do is play, uh, if bishop uh, e4, uh, g6, bishop takes g6, uh, h takes g6, queen takes g6, check, king uh, h8, and then we can play rook takes d6, something like that. I'm thinking that might be, uh, yeah. Oh, I think you're right. Yeah, he went a piece. Sorry, rook takes d6 first. The other way it doesn't work, the queen escapes. Then g takes h5, and then rook takes uh, e6. There you go, yeah. This rook takes is, is, is the first move, then you, uh, then you win a piece, yeah.
takes h4 uh, check uh, king uh, g3 and then knight uh, f6 I think that's that's the move Well, the reason I was thinking uh, queen takes h4 might not be the right move is because of king takes f3. Uh, <clears throat> So we're thinking queen takes h4. Queen takes d2. Okay. That makes sense. I got this. Uh, queen takes h6 check. King um, g8. Queen takes. Oh, queen takes can't do that. Because of uh, that. Yeah, that wouldn't. Uh, that would not be uh, really a good idea. Um, hmm. Ah, that, well, so bishop takes and then rook takes. Okay, rook takes, king takes. Uh, there, check. Huh. Okay, rook uh, takes, rook e8. Ah, yeah, then rook takes. Oh, yeah, that, that, that would, that would, uh, yeah. And then uh, queen takes rook. Yeah. Wow, that's very interesting move to say the least okay let's see if we can do uh, eight more on this one come on we can do this we can we can hang in there for eight more come on and then I got then I do got a log cuz <laughs> I'll be tuckered out after this These, uh, this was fun though. I did learn a whole bunch on the tactics though. So it was worth uh, going the distance. Okay, um, let's, we gotta stay focused now so that we can get to 80 within time. Let me see here. Um, so knight, knight takes f7, king takes f7, bishop takes f7. Well, maybe no. Let's see, knight takes. Just knight takes g6? No, knight takes f6 is more forcing. Then rook takes. That's it. Rook takes f6. That's it. Yeah, this. Yeah, and. Oh, wow. 
So then uh, bishop takes uh, e6 should uh, win on the spot that I can see. Let's see here. We takes, retakes. Yeah. So H4. Ah. Yeah. I think, uh, uh, yeah, a, uh, oh, king g3. Ah, uh, queen takes, yeah. Okay, let's get going on this one. 
yeah, it works. Thinking uh, rook a7 check, king b2, rook b7 check, uh, king a2, uh, rook h2 check, maybe I'm thinking. Ooh, that would work too. Can you see one? Yeah, I like that. Might be seven now. So rook b1, no we can't play, we can't do rook b1. So. Rook f3. That's the move. Wow. And then root takes. Root takes uh, c3 at that point, then. Root takes c3. And then root takes f3. I think that's I think it's because it stops the the pawn. Oh, rook b2 forks. <coughs> Excuse me, forks the pawn. Okay. Okay, here, let me see. Five more. Let's do it. Okay. Let's see here. Pop push. Change. Change.
I'm thinking. R uh, Rotate says six. Okay. Takes. No. Oh, wow. Okay. I was thinking then now about um, E6 at this point, but I'm not sure. Yeah. Oops. Uh oh. That was my bad. Sorry. That was that was my fault there. Well, uh, yeah. Let's see here. So knight of uh, six. I'm thinking we could play b5 here. b5, f3, uh, b6, f2, b7, f1, equal, whoa, actually we can't do that. Um, we can't do b7, we'd have to do knight to e3, and then we'd have to do something. What do you think? Are you uh, in agreement on uh, B5? B six ninety one check So knight B, so pawn B six. So B six, B six, ninety one, and then King C three, right? Oops, B B six, ninety one, uh, King C three. Is that is that what we're uh, planning? Is that the plan? Yeah. Ah, gotcha. Okay. So knight uh, e2, if knight comes there, then uh, we can pick up a pawn with knight g6. Yeah, that makes sense. Oops. Yeah. 87. Knight g6. Knight takes. e5. Is it knight c3? Is 
is it knight uh, c4? I think knight c4. Oh, no, 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 no. Knight, knight g4. Sorry, knight g4 check. Knight g4, I believe, is the move. Yeah, let's go. Let's try that. Knight c4. Okay, we've got four more. Come on. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. Give you a second. I was thinking about um, uh, Rook uh, G2 to start out with. I'll be right back. B7. Rook one Okay, B2. Uh, Rook 7 Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. Uh, and then uh, we have to go back to attack the... Yeah. Then we attack the queen... Uh, the... Yep, this actually attacks the bishop, and then we can, oops. Then we can actually check with the rook on b to, uh, b7. Oh, no, what? Did I do it wrong? Oh, no. King a3? Why, why king, why? Oh, oh, snap. Oh, I missed that.
Okay. Sorry about that, team. Well, I'm gonna have to call it on this one. So let's uh, let's go over the ones that uh, we I missed here. Because I know you guys had the lines all 110%. And then, yep. That was, that was the one that we talked about here. Um, retakes. And I'm thinking this one was a check that I missed here. And then uh, E takes. Yeah, that was that was the one I I I got the, these moves. Yeah, rook a a was the one that I I I missed. I got the move orders wrong. I was playing that first, but then I I uh, actually came back. The I, my idea was here, and then here 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 here, and then check. But it was I got the lines mixed up. This is the for, first move to keep the king further away from the position then there's no way for the king to get back in time to promote all like that and the rook covers the promotion square okay okay this is the sad one but here and then h7 and then um, what you can do now is rook b7 here and then you can actually take oops you can't take yet you have to actually, cause I, I think that's I think there's a again a stale mating threat. I think it's King F, King F two, and then we can take. Okay, so that that's that's the move. So first we check there there, um, check. King F2, he, we're off of this diag, uh, light square diagonal, which then there's no more um, checks that our opponent can do, and the bishop's free to, to roam the board, whatever it wants to do. Okay. So let's, we'll go over them one more quick time and then we'll, uh, then I gotta say do on this one. Okay, that one there. Takes here, check there, there, and that wins. And then one more for the road. Check, check 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 takes okay do you have any questions before I uh, go uh, before I uh, log off I'll give you a minute just to put in any questions if you have any on the puzzles or anything Because I know sometimes there may be a lag on the server. Oops. Sorry about that. Alright, perfect. Nothing. Alrighty. Wanted to thank you, uh, um, all in one play for uh, participating and uh, Team Chess Cruncher don't uh, ever fear that you uh, can't participate as well you're more than welcome to great job on 76 one second on we will check 
we will check really quick to see where that puts us in the ratings so that uh, all of our hard work okay we are number one we have 76 perfect so congratulations on number one and uh, we'll get we'll get better and stronger and uh, more uh, we'll get those puzzles down quicker so don't don't you worry but what you have to first do is take what you know be able to apply it be willing to do something with it and always remember to treasure your victories and learn from your losses or remember that mistakes do not define you. it's how you handle the mistake that defines you and you know what always remember uh, to always go for, for for the move so that because uh, I remember on one, one of the shows that I watched they, uh, one of the uh, people said that the worst thing you can do is to not try because if you don't try or do your best you'll never be able to learn because life is about making mistakes and that's why uh, it's a mistake not to receive the Lord Jesus Lord and Savior of your life like chess is like moves on the board that's important as well and the team chess crutcher motto is what we uh, rely on because uh, uh, it will help you improve in all areas we you, you gotta hang first of all hang up your coats my friends hang up your coat uh, hang up your hats sit down and study when most won't team chess cruncher does and that makes all all the difference difference see we uh, that that's the one thing we have to always remember is I'm gonna say it one more time because I think I may have missed one of them we hang up our coats we hang up our hats we sit down and study when most won't team chess cruncher does and that makes all the difference and as Wesley so says serve the Lord Jesus as I say God bless I'll see you next time on chess cruncher TV have a blessed morning afternoon and evening Lord will and I'll be back on tomorrow we'll keep pushing forward two thumbs up hoorah be blessed um, you know what you remember what Hannibal Smith said even inside of a random position my friends there's always a plan and when you see it I love it when a plan comes to there you get to, you get to say that I love it when a plan comes together Okay, hoorah, be blessed. Great job on 76, Team Chess Cruncher. Go Team Chess Cruncher, be blessed, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.